Hi, in this video I will be talking about the match tool in Carb EQ from Kilohertz. Now what this tool does is it helps you uh, in mixing your song by sort of stealing the equalization from another song, a reference song that you have lying about, and applying that to your song to make uh, yeah, the mean frequency values in your song match those of a reference. So what you need to do to start with is to record a portion of your track to make it uh, to create a sort of a profile for the match tool to use to match it against other songs. So click record. Wait for a while wait for a while to see that it builds up a sort of a nice average of your song. When you feel like you're done, you press stop and you see this green little check mark here. And from there, you can select a reference. So you can choose a sidechain channel if you like. You can choose pizza, apparently, which is the previously loaded uh, profile. You can choose any of a, a bunch of factory profiles here. And uh, it will preview uh, the sound of the song uh, with the matching, with the matched to the reference uh, while you're hovering the songs like this. So you can even use your arrow keys to go step by step like this. Get the how about get the party started. So this is a little extreme, but I can use the amount knob to dial it down a lot. Just get a hint of, of the reference like this. Once I have selected a, a target, I can also set the detail on the matching. So lower detail, almost like a straight curve like this, and higher detail, I get more of the fine <laughs> points of this. Beware though, this is uh, kind of a dangerous thing to do to go too high on details because in the, uh, especially in the low end, you're gonna get peaks on specific notes. And you can see this better if you choose semitone uh, spectrum mode, so you can see each note like this. So try to keep it on a, on a nice detail level. You can also do the stereo. Uh, matching by enabling the, by pushing the stereo button. So that's it for the match tool.